In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to make a rubber band spiral. Here are the materials I used for it. I used two different colored bands and two pencils with an eraser taped in between. So to start to make a spiral, you're gonna make a figure eight with your first rubber band and your first color. So yeah, you'll cross it once to make the figure eight. Now you only make a figure eight with the first band, you'll just put bands on normally for the vest. Now that we have three rubber bands on, we're going to take the one side of the figure eight from the bottom and pull it up and over and do that with the other side too. Now, I, most people don't do this, but this is something that I do. Once I have the first loop on, I put the S-clip inside of it just to mark my place and so that I don't lose it when I'm trying to clip it. So now we're going to take another rubber band and put it on. And then we're going to take the bottom uh, band and pull it up and over just like we did for the figure eight. And we're going to keep on doing that until it's until you get to the point where you think it's long enough for whatever style of jewelry you're making. So right now I'm making a ring since it takes the least amount of time. So I'm going to show you this like three more times maybe. And then that should give enough for you to do it on your own until the next part. Or I might try it one more time. Depends. Okay, so that's how it looks like right now. Now that I've finished with this one part, I'm going to flip it upside down. Just like that, no tricks or anything, just putting it upside down. Now I'm going to take my second color band and as you see, I'm putting it around. It's all the way around there. So now you're going to do it just like normal on how you did for the first part and your first color or more. But the only difference is that you'll be, um, sorry, you'll be putting it around the first part for every time. I'll do this three more times to show you and then I'll be back with the next part and they did fall off I just wanted to show you that you can put more than one on at a time during this part Once you're done, it should look like this. So now what you're going to do is, if you put the clip on like I did, you're going to take it off and take those two ends and put it, and put them onto the two pencils. 
just like so. And now I forgot to do this, but you're gonna scoot it down if you don't have enough room to make sure they don't fall off. And now you're going to do it like normal and bring the bottom band up. And we, you haven't done this before, but now you're gonna take the other band and bring it back up. So the new bottom band will be brought up and over, just like the old one was. And now you're going to take that first, that last band remaining and bring it to the other side of the pencil so they're both on one side. Make sure it doesn't fall off. Now you're gonna grab your S clip or C clip, whatever you use. And you're just gonna hook it around the end there. And then you're going to go to the other side and hook it on the end there, which I was very bad at doing. And this is what it should look like when you're done.